All right. So the Infinix Note 11 will be the next smartphone from Infinix that will be launched very soon. And Tech Inspiration has already linked some of the pictures and some of the information about the Infinix Note 11. Now, big shout out to Tech Inspiration. If you are yet to watch the video, I will link it below the description. Just click it and watch it on Tech Inspiration channel. Now, but the information I have here, the link I have here, is a bit different from what Tech Inspiration posted. The comparing this link side by side, you see that the Infinix Note 11 model number I have is the one with X698. Why that of Tech Inspiration posted had X663 and X663B. So are there differences between these two? Is it that I'm correct and text expression is wrong? Not likely. You know, the two links are correct, but it shows it is coming from different dimensions. What tech expression posted was base variant, the one with six gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of internal storage. And that will be powered by the MediaTek NU G80 chipset. And that also will run out of the bus XOS 8.0 which is real that is real you see the life images it is real however the one i have will be the high-end variant of the infinix note 11 that will come with 8 gigs of ram and 120 gigs of internal storage and the shift set to power the infinix note 11 variant i have is different from the one that tech inspiration posted which is the x six six three and x six six three b also in terms of the camera the one that was linked by tech inspiration the infinite 11 x six six three had 50 megapixel main camera the one i have might come with different camera sensor and it will be more sophisticated than what you have in the base variants so the chipset definitely is different that means in terms of performance the one i have the infinite 11 x 698 would be a better performer than the base variant of the 6 gigabyte RAM. Now you can tell easily comparing or uh, relating previously to the Infinix Note 10 series that was launched. The Note 10 chipset was different from the Note 10 Pro chipset. The Note 10 Pro was more sophisticated with G95 chipset that was different from the G85 found in the Infinix Note 10. So same fit will also be, uh, we also repeat itself here. The Note 11 I have will be more sophisticated in terms of performance, in terms of chipset, and in terms of RAM size than the one Tech Inspiration leaked a few days ago. So big shout out to Tech Inspiration for the link of the base variants, but there are still more to know about the high-end variants of the Infinix Note 11. I don't know more information will be coming and I will drop them or review them at a more convenient time. So not to miss out, hit the subscribe button, turn on the post bell and also follow me on social media, Twitter, Instagram and Facebook at MyZ. Now, but one thing I want you guys to know is that Infinix has really stepped up. The Infinix Note 11, Note 10 last few months came with uh, IPS LCD touchscreen, but the Infinix Note 11 will be bringing Super AMOLED touchscreen. Even the base variant that was leaked by Tech Inspiration also have an AMOLED touchscreen. So enough or a lot of improvements from Infinix. How do you feel with this improvement with 8 gigs of RAM and good uh, uh, software SOS 8.0 that is built somehow in the likeness of Android 12? There is really so much to talk about, and over time I'll be revealing them on this channel. All right, I'd love to know your opinion in the comment section, knowing that there's two or three variants of the Infinix Note 11 that will be coming in a few months' time. Let me know what you think. It's my GA. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you around in my next one.